we're gonna get kinky here. <laughs> channel today I've got a great big wish haul I chose nine mini dresses to try out and they're all types of mini dresses <laughs> some of them are a little bit longer some of them are really short and um, I just really didn't know what to expect when I got these dresses in fact a lot of them are quite nice but then some of them are definite no's like stuff that does not even make sense <laughs> at all so, of course, I ordered these things on Wish.com. They all came individually. There are two more that are still on their way and I do not have the patience to wait anymore. So <laughs> I've got nine here that I'm gonna give a shot and let you know my thoughts. So I purchased everything myself and I just had this idea to do like a mini dress haul. A lot of these things um, are like the picture and then some of them aren't. So I'm going to also insert the photo of the item that I bought so you can compare it to how it actually looks in real life because that's the biggest thing with Wish I think is um, it's almost like they look at a photo or the photo they use in their website and they try to copy the garment exactly and sometimes sometimes it's a win and sometimes it's a total fail. Do I have a lipstick on my teeth? And this is going to be an interesting try on for sure because some of the stuff is like Halloween costume worthy. Like this is not stuff that I would really wear in my real life. A couple items I think I will, but let's get into it. All right. So the first item that I bought is a total fail. So I ordered a size medium and this is what came in. So this is me and this is the dress. It's gigantic. Um, Typically, I order size mediums in most things, like if I'm shopping on Zaffle or American Eagle or whatever, medium is my size, typically. Um, so this dress is a size medium and it's huge. The quality is not bad. It's got like a nice metal zipper that unzips the entire way. Um, and the fabric is kind of like the stretchy, I don't know, fake, shiny material <laughs> it's just too big for me this in no way is a size medium like this isn't large or extra large uh, it is stretchy so I just wish it fit because it actually is really cute like in the photo you'll see it looks really nice on and it pretty much looks like the photo if it was the size that I ordered but this is a fail <laughs> looked really pretty okay not because I was planning on wearing it to church or something um, here it is so it's basically a tube of fabric um, again similar to the last dress it's that same kind of shiny material and it's not um, uncomfortable by any means right it's not um, it does feel breathable like if you look at the inside I feel like you could wear this for a period of time and it wouldn't, you know, stop your skin from breathing. You wouldn't sweat to death or anything. Um, I love the color. Uh, it's got some like, you know, stitching seam threads sticking out here, but um, it's super short. So I have a long torso, so I understand that this might look shorter on me than it will on anybody else. Um, I just, I don't know. I don't own anything like this. Um, I could maybe wear it as a skirt, but still, uh, it's more of a fun kind of playful dress, but, uh, yeah, I love the color. It does fit pretty nicely, uh, aside the fact from half my butt is hanging at the bottom, but, uh, I would recommend it if you're looking for something like this. Uh, it is tight, but again, it is stretchy. So, um, so yeah, that's that one. Thank you. 
actually quite nice. It's a little longer than I'd like, even though it depicts that in the photo. It's this deep V-neck. I didn't wear a bra when I tried it on, by the way. It def you definitely need to wear a bra. <laughs> um, and it's pretty long. Um, it's this material, I don't know how if you can see this. So the inside material is really super duper soft and the outside. So it's almost like those really soft, stretchy leggings you can get. Um, this is a good winter dress. I feel like it would definitely look stylish and keep you warm. Um, the length is what it is. I prefer shorter lengths, but then again, a lot of times when I buy a dress, um, every step I take, it gets shorter and shorter and shorter. <laughs> Uh, so this might be a good thing. With some high, like high knee over the knee boots, um, I think it would be very nice. So I do like this. stuff here in a minute <laughs> okay so this one uh, is very nude and is actually a good nude for my color if you're looking for this type of dress I don't know what I was thinking I guess in my mind I'm always dreaming of being a few shades darker <laughs> um, but I am the same color as this right now so it looks a little bit it might look a little bit silly um, but basically it's like a long maxi dress and it looked really cool in the photo and it's not a bad dress, like it's not really bad, it's not super cheap, but it is ripped right here. And so that's a, that's a crappy thing. So that would tick me off. If I loved this, like, and I really wanted to wear it, that would really upset me. But because I'm probably not going to wear this anytime soon, uh, it's not, doesn't bother me that much. But still! It should not come ripped. Um, it's got these panels in the front that kind of open up and it's got the center piece that covers up all of your party parts. And uh, it's a little bit sheer, but you know, it is what it is. It is a bit short for me as well. I am 5'8", so this is, you know, if you're anything shorter than me, like 5'5", five five, this, is, this is a perfect length for you. This also comes, I think, in black and red and maybe white. Uh, but I just got this color because, I don't know, if I was darker, I guess you'll see the photo of the model wearing it and you'll kind of see exactly why I liked this dress. A crazy dress it's a two-piece dress and it is it's like um it mimics latex <laughs> so here is the top it's like a very structured top it was a bit hard to get on but it does kind of fit the cups need to be a little bit bigger and they're sort of an awkward shape you'll see in the footage but um, I pulled it off and the skirt, I don't even know how I got this thing on. So even though, here's a skirt, it's like a longer skirt, split in the back, zipper in the back. Um, I don't know how this actually stretches. It actually does. Like it looks stiff, but it is kind of stretchy. So that helps <laughs> when it comes to getting it on. Again, this is not typically something that I would wear but I think it's really sexy. And if you are going to be, I don't know, going to some event and you want to stand out a bit, rather than wear a typical little black dress, I mean, this would be a really good option and it fits me pretty good. 
58% polyester, 42% polyamid, polyamide. Anyway, so yeah, this is a size medium and uh, it's interesting, that's for sure. next thing this next dress is another one of these but it has straps and it's about the same length it's pretty short um, I don't know what it is I feel like like this kind of shiny type fabric is so pretty you know what I mean like it's almost I know that they're probably you know when you buy a Halloween costume a superhero costume it's made from this like similar material, but I do like it. And I do think that it looks pretty on. It's very short. Where I would wear this, I do not know. We are within the October month. So I feel like if there's a month where you're gonna get away with wearing something crazy, it's October. So who knows, I might sport this somewhere. I don't know, I've got a couple Halloween parties to go to, so <laughs> who knows? But uh, interesting, and if you are looking for something like this, I do recommend it, because it fits pretty nicely, so. next thing I don't know what I was thinking I don't know what I was thinking I guess on the model it almost looked like there was a, a slip that it came with um, and I think the model is a bit darker skin so it, I just didn't I don't know let's just let's just go over it here so clearly this is not something that I can wear on camera um, it's this stretchy lace and then it has this extra little detail at the bottom fits pretty nicely uh, I don't know what I was thinking, as I mentioned. <laughs> uh, so in order to try this on, I wore a one-piece swimsuit underneath, just a black swimsuit underneath. It looks ridiculous. Like, <laughs> just warning you, it looks ridiculous. Uh, it fits quite well for what it is, and it would be really sexy, like, as just throwing it on as a piece of lingerie. I think that would be fun with, like, some black high heels or something. Um, but, you know... I had to put something underneath. You guys understand, I'm sure. next guy this last dress so a lot of you this is gonna be your favorite one I know 
Um, but the first thing I have to say about this dress is it reeks. It smells so bad. So just so you know, it smells like, I don't even know. I don't even know, like really smelly rubber mixed with like rotten fish. I don't know. It's kind of, it's a chemically smell. It's not like a rotten smell. It's like a chemical smell, but it's a different kind of weird chemical smell. Anyway, that aside, um, this is a, this is quite comfortable, this dress. And I wish it was a little bit tighter. Like I wish that it hugged me a little bit better. I think it would be more comfortable the way that it fits now. Um, on the inside, it has this, come on. Um, kind of like this padded cup here. The only problem I really found with it is, besides the smell, <laughs> is, so this cup here is sewn with the liner exposed a bit, and this is a little bit off center. So when you wear it, it makes your boobs look like they're kind of like off, or there's something not right about it, uh, just because of the way that it's made. So, I mean, I, I'd have to air this out for six weeks before even considering wearing it. Um, I'd be kind of afraid that whatever chemical is in this would be um, saturating my skin and taking five years off my life. I don't know. <laughs> long zipper down the back and it's a longer length. I just think like for what it is and for the price, sure. You know, if you're gonna be something uber sexy for Halloween, like Jessica Rabbit or something, go for it. Uh, but consider that this is not gonna smell nice. And if you go out in this, like if you open this and put it on, you're like, woo, it's Halloween night, and you're going out, and people are gonna be like, did you smell her? <laughs> and so I'm gonna put this back in a bag and like outside <laughs> or something. <laughs> What did you think? What was your favorite? Um, what was my favorite? I think the black latex looking dress was my favorite of all of them. Um, and I can't say it was a total fail. Um, I was actually expecting it to be a total fail, like nothing to be what it was, what they said it was, like what they depicted on the website. Uh, but most of the stuff worked and even though some stuff might be different what they show in the photo. It doesn't mean it's a terrible product, but you know, you can't, it's almost like how is it even legal to sell somebody something that's not as it's depicted? You know what I mean? Like, but you also have to realize that for the price, like if you're paying $4 for the item and then $3 for shipping, like for a total of $7, are you really expecting a lot? <laughs> honestly. So let me know if you have any other ideas for me for try-ons from Wish. I've already ordered, already? I've already ordered a ton of sweaters because I'm curious. Like some of these photos look really, really cute and I'm curious to see if the sweaters come as they're depicted or if they're just totally off. I think it's going to be one or the other. Um, so stay tuned for that. Also, you guys, make sure you're following me on Instagram. I'm at cat.wonders. And also, if you'd like access to some behind the scenes stuff, you have access to exclusive weekly videos, exclusive photos, and contact me directly. Also, monthly gifts and all sorts of extra fun stuff. Then head on over to my Patreon page. Go to www.patreon.com slash catwonders and maybe become one of my little wonder cats. So you guys, I want to say a huge thank you for tuning in today. I hope you're having an amazing day. It's fall. I'm in the autumn spirit. Um, I can't wait to start whipping out the sweaters and the tall boots. And um, I hope you're as excited for Halloween as I am. 
So you guys, again, thanks so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video.